Well, here we are in the middle of the Oster Park jungle. You may notice a bit of semi-animal documentary whispering going on. That's because I'm in a whispery mood. Um, I did promise you an emotional vlog, a vlog in which I bear my soul and share some of the things that cause pain and suffering in my life. So here goes. Gray, gray skies, gray skies, two, three days of gray skies, and my spirit is down. I barely make it through those days, but I'm fortunate, and I'm fortunate because I've got a team of wonderful therapists who you see standing before you. Those are the gulls. I talk to the gulls, and I feel good again. Without the gulls, I wouldn't manage to make it through the gray, and um, even though they begged me not to film them, uh, the fact that I have a camera in my hand means I don't care what they think. I'm just going to do what I need to do, and that is make an emotional vlog, a vlog, a vlog, sorry, vlog, V, not B, V, do you hear me, V, yes, the letter V, that one, to make an emotional vlog in which you will weep and understand my anguish. So, how is that? Does that sound emotional enough? <laughs> okay, let me see if I can wind up the drama. I feel terrible. I feel ghastly. How about that? Is that good enough? Yes. Okay, anyway, look, here are my team. These are fantastic girls. Anytime I have a problem, I come and talk to them. They listen, give me tips, ask me questions. Um, you see that one over? No, not that one, the other one. Yes, no, yes, that one. That's Rodney, Rodney the girl. He doesn't like his name Rodney. He'd like to be called Wilbur, but uh, his parents called him Rodney. That's the way it is. Sharpest mind I've ever met, really. I mean, smarter than most human beings. Rodney is amazing. Anyway, I'm not going to... Um, talk too much, we'll try and get a bit closer. There's a good chance, there's a good chance the team will flee <laughs> and decide that uh, <laughs> they don't want to join in the party. Sometimes this does happen. It's, uh, such is the nature of um, psychiatrist gulls. You see, gulls come back here. Don't run away. No, 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 please come back, come back. We're in the middle of an emotional vlog. You must stay. You must, you must tell the audience how much I've suffered. Tell them, please, tell them. Say to the audience, this man has suffered so much, he's making an emotional vlog. <laughs> okay, well, there's that. Um, I'm going to... Ah, yes, they are uh, the necessary... Um, I just threw it in there. So, while we are here in the jungle of Oster Park, the jungle of Oster Park is one of the most terrifying spots in Amsterdam. You move through here at your own peril. There's no idea who you'll meet. Joggers especially. You're walking there, minding your own business. Suddenly a jogger comes by. And when it's gray, the shock is even worse. As I told you, I suffer from gray skies. I have gray sky phobia. It's a very rare thing, and that makes me extremely special. In fact, I should have a television show because I have gray sky phobia. Okay, while still whispering in my deep and soothing voice. <laughs> Slowly slipping out of control here on this emotional vlog. As you understand, my emotions are, well, they're all over the place. And so, um, yeah, I'm now going to switch the camera around. Hopefully you don't get too dizzy. Hopefully it behaves a little. You know, this, this I, I feel it has its own mind, especially on an emotional day such as this. It won't listen, it won't, uh, it won't obey commands. Anyway, I'm walking to this rotunda. And from this rotunda, you have a nice view out over the park. I'll try and walk in a gentle fashion so the camera doesn't bobble too much. And if it does, just think of it as a cool move, something you can swing along to, you know, whistle your favorite tune as the camera hops up and down on this extremely emotional vlog the vlog where I bear my soul, where I where I weep in public. Boo hoo boo hoo, there's my weeping. Okay, right, we're almost at the middle of the rotunda. 
we're, no, we're almost at the entrance of the road. Was, sorry, that was fake news. I, I apologize, it's not my fault. Okay, here we are. Look at this. You're looking at that building over there. That's the Tropen Institute. But I think part of it is now commercial, so you have offices and the cafe and stuff like that. And then over here, over here, no, not over there. Camera, please turn. Don't misbehave. That's, I'm sorry about that. The camera is wild. Yes, that is a gym. It's an open air gym, and every so often I see people, you know, stretching their muscles, doing some good stuff on those hoops and the rings. You'll also notice uh, a flock of human beings walking, some of them with their bicycles. Bicycles are a method of transport, favor, a favorite method of transport or means of transport in Amsterdam. Um, tourists join in and often cause a lot of chaos. Uh, they should uh, have lessons before coming here. But anyway, there's that. Let's see if we can swing around and see some of the people here. Yes. Uh -huh. There you see a couple in the foreground. Uh -huh. Yeah, they're sort of taking pictures of themselves. I'm very happy about it. Anyway, I'm now going to... Whoops, sorry. The camera went the wrong way. I'm now going to swing around. Please don't get seasick. This is an emotional vlog. I understand your emotions must be running high. And um, everybody incredibly insane at this particular emotional moment. Okay, I think um, that's all the emotion I have in me at this minute. I'm drained. I'm, uh, if you could see me now, I'd be on my knees crawling to the edge of the rotunda, wondering how have I survived the grey up until now. But I have, I have, and um, I'm grateful for it. So on that note, I'm going to say a very, very, very emotional goodbye.